What's up guys, Tony Cedar here. I'm on a Cyber Simulator today for a quick little video. Before I get into the video, I just want to say if you are new to the channel or not subscribed, it would really mean the world to me if you hit that subscribe button. Help me on my road to 10,000 subscribers. Please turn on the post notification bell with all notifications turned on so you don't miss out my future videos, live streams and pick giveaways in various games. Please feel free to leave a comment in the section down below as I do try to respond to all comments that are left. Okay guys, so in today's video, um, I'm going to be classing up to the newest class which is the skeleton class and we're going to see how uh, overpowered this class will be once we get it um, obviously do a correlation between the 200,000 uh, crane boost from Hydra to the 750,000 crane boost for skeleton see what the actual difference is and how much additional we get from the boss also we're going to see how quick it does actually take me to get back up to max sabers once I do buy uh, the skeleton class so as you guys know in my update video i showed you the max saber which is this one here uh just to get down here because i keep going past it so here's the one that it is which is the skeletal blade which matches the actual class so this is the heaven one and it does give you 24.76 v a swing and as you can see uh, it does cost 147 billion 820 million 70,878.237 KU coins and if I remember correctly when I did buy all 20 sabers um it cost I think just under a trillion or something um can't be 100% certain until, unless I go and look at the video that I posted but in that video I do actually tell you exactly how much it did cost to buy all 20 sabers from the update so as I said guys, we are going to be uh, upgrading to the skeleton class and we're going to see how overpowered this class is and I'm going to do a timeless video of me grinding to get back to max sabers. So I'm just going to put my timer in the top left corner so you can actually see the, the timer itself. Also you can actually see that the game update here is in 20 hours, 20 minutes and 15 seconds. Um, so basically you will actually see the countdown timer here going um obviously up and this going down so you can actually see that um i am actually doing it in the time that i'm actually recording on the uh, timer so you know that i'm not actually uh, skipping parts out to try and make it faster or slower so this is actually a true reflection of how long it would take to get back up to the skeleton class um obviously i am using some uh, pretty decent pets at the moment so as you can see, I'm using obviously the Rainbow Inferno Electric um, Trip Moon Pets. And as you can see, this one gives me 3,394,850 strength and coins. And my lowest one gives me 3,256,687. And then obviously I've got a 69 level and a 68 level just here. So you can see 3.31 mil and 3.33 mil. So these pets are quite overpowered. So if uh, you've got similar pets uh, with similar stats or just slightly less stats, then it may take a little bit longer to obviously get back up to max sabers if you're going to be doing the same thing. Or it might take you um, quick, uh, less time if you've got pets with higher stats than mine. So as I said, we are going to be buying the uh, skeletal class. So I'm going to buy that now, guys, and get that out of the way. So as you can see here, uh, this class does actually cost... 16 trillion 653 billion 663 million 250,000 552.1 KU coins so um, I'm going to say goodbye to all my coins here that I've actually collected now these coins are obviously what I've been getting from uh, selling my strength and also collecting the daily reward um, as I say in every video, or most videos anyway, the daily reward is the best thing in game at the moment. It gives you 10% uh, boost on what you have in your coin um, amount here and your crown amount. So the higher amount you've got here, the better um, boost you're going to get. So every, ten, every time you collect, it's 10% on that current total. So if you just keep letting it go up and up and up, you're going to get more and more each time. And as I say numerous times, it's the best thing in game at the moment, guys. This is the actual um, method in the game that will get you enough coins and crowns to keep leveling up, keep uh, getting the best sabers, and also being able to hatch um, the uh, best eggs in the game. Now, I have actually uploaded a video on how to use the daily reward. 
so if you do want to obviously check that video out there is a link in the description down below um it is a little bit outdated now but i am going to be doing a up-to-date version um at some point just to obviously make it a bit more modern so if you do want to check that out that does give you the basic information of how to use it um and obviously back then when i done it i told you how much you needed to get to um to obviously start um getting a decent amount of boost and hatching the pets but now obviously the posts of the eggs are getting further and further um, apart from then uh, i am going to be redoing at some point and telling you what you roughly need to get to start obviously using the daily reward to be able to hatch the best eggs so i will get that done at some point but as i said in this video today i'm going to be uh, upgrading to the skeleton class seeing how overpowered it is and see how quick um, i can get back up to max sabers so uh, first things first let's buy the skeleton class and say goodbye to my coins uh, my strength and obviously my sabers so you can see all my sabers have been released so removed uh, got the award down here skeleton award so if i just go back up to the top here and then go to the first saber so you can see here i've got that one equipped and my next one is the green saber so as i said guys i'm going to be doing a time lapse video um while i do this and you will obviously see the timer go up here and you'll also see the game update timer go down so you can actually see that it is a true re uh, reflection from um, me doing the grinding to the time it's going down because this uh, game update time here cannot be changed unless uh, the developer changes it but obviously you know that this is for the countdown for the update so what I'm going to do guys I'm going to do the time last video now and when I do get back up to uh, Max Sabres uh, I will slow the video down. We will obviously do a correlation between the Hydra and the Skeleton class for the 750 times crown boost from the boss and see how much um, additional crowns we do actually get from that boss. So I'll be right back after I've got back to Max Sabres, guys. <laughs> Okay guys, so I've slowed the video down. As you can see, I've got the skeleton blade equipped from the shop, which is the Heaven Skeletal Blade, which is the best one in the game at the moment, as you can see there. So I've managed to get that uh, Max Saber back within 26 minutes and 51 seconds. So pretty decent uh, time to obviously get back to Max uh, Sabers. Just going to buy uh, all DNAs again, so I've got everything in the shop. So I'm just going to scroll down, make sure everything's there before re-equipping the infinite DNA. Here it is. Okay, so I'll re-equip that. So as you can see, I've got max sabers now. I've got max DNA, um, and I've got the max skeleton class. So uh, everything's max in the shop now, guys. So we've got the best one available. So we are going to be doing a cross correlation between the hydra class and the skeleton class so we're going to obviously see what we do per swing um from the hydra class so just to uh, re-equip that but before obviously um i do uh do the swing i just want to say while you're uh, classing up uh, sorry while you're getting your sabers i would recommend doing as much on the ground floor as possible so uh, do obviously your swings sell and then keep running backwards and forwards uh, from sell to shop until you um, can't get many sabers anymore so once you start slowing down to about one or two sabers then go up to the max island that um, you are on and utilize the boost okay so uh, we're just going to see look at um how much we do per swing in a second so as you can see i do 30.32 kk so we're gonna re-equip the skeleton um uh hang on, just make sure it's so 30 sorry 30.32 uh kk so we're gonna re-equip the skeleton and as you can see now i do 30.386 kk so that's an increase of 6.066 um, kk per second so pretty decent increase from the skeleton to uh, sorry from hydra to skeleton now it does obviously show you in here how much you're going to get anyway uh, but the correlation we're going to be doing in a second is the actual crown boost from the boss 
so we are going to obviously see how many crowns we get from the boss from the um hydra to skeleton so just re-equip the hydra and i'm going to go and destroy the boss so as you can see here i'm just attacking the boss now um obviously the timer off stopped because that was just showing how long it would take to get back to max sabers um but you can see i'm already at um 26 k uh, sorry capital u so it's obviously going up uh gradually so pretty decent amount of cranes i'm getting from the boss at the moment so just keep uh destroying the boss i've done over well i've done over half a damage now um so hopefully doesn't take that much longer maybe another minute or so so when i do obviously get down to the slightest bit of uh, boss hp points um i will slow down just to see so i will stop attacking the boss just to see how much we have in crowns and then we'll kill the boss and see um how much it goes up to so as you can see um just over well, just over 100 left so stop at 60 one more hit so i'm at 118 point one nine four capital u so i'm just gonna kill this boss now and that will increase so i'll try and capture that so we're at 118.791 so 118.791 capital u so just gonna go over here now and re-equip the skeleton uh, class and what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna um pause the video now until the three minute timeout has gone so we don't obviously have three minutes of nothing and then i'll be right back once the boss has respawned okay guys so i've uh, resumed the video as you can see the boss has just uh, respawned with the 3000 hit points so we're gonna start destroying this boss now and we'll obviously see how much we get from uh the skeleton class and the uh, boss so we had um 118.791 capital u um from that uh hydra class and as you can see so far with the skeleton class i've actually uh blown that out of the water already um i'm already over a hundred 100 capital u just from this uh skeleton class so you can see the skeleton class is way op for crowns so we will obviously uh carry on until we do finish destroying this boss so let's uh, get him down quite low and then we'll stop and then we can obviously see exactly what it is but you can see it's quite uh, quite high at the moment so there's 105 75 45 uh, then 15 so as you can see guys 400 um, and 45.465 capital U now when i do actually destroy the boss that should slightly go up so four four five oh okay so just stayed at four six u so um that is actually a pretty decent increase guys so it goes from 118 uh capital u uh just obviously ran it off at 118 up to 445 uh u so you are talking over 300 um and 23 or 27 capital u increase at a rough estimate so as you can see the skeleton class is way op for crown boost so um if you are obviously trying to get enough crowns to open the uh, best eggs in game then it's best to actually keep uh classing up to the new classes because as you can see from hydra to skeleton it's over 300 capital u increased crowns just from the boss um and if uh, you um remember the egg cost on the top island is 90.7 capital u so that's uh, each boss will give you three um eggs to open obviously that is depending on what um you have in your pets as well guys so that's what i get with obviously my pets giving me um from 250 to 271 thousand crown boost so these four pets here are giving me roughly about 1 million crown boost um but as i said even if you've got lower pets you will still get a pretty decent increase from the hydra to the skeleton class you should still get that 300 and um 27 give or take i believe 
uh, increase even if you've got less uh, stats than me because it goes off the actual class boost itself so what if you get with your current pet and the hydro class you will get that additional 300 and something on top if you class up to skeleton class so it is well worth uh, keep classing up guys because obviously we get uh, the crown boost which will help uh, in the long run to open the eggs for future updates also it gives you that additional boost for your strength and coins which will get you your sabers a lot quicker fingers crossed um, and as you can see if you start from uh, the the alien class that's when you start getting the crown boost but then as you can see it goes all the way up to starts off at 25 uh, crowns and then it goes up to 750,000 times so being this was 200,000 and that's an additional 550,000 on top of there um, potentially we may have 550,000 on the top of the other one so we could be looking at uh, 1.2 mil or higher um, I'd I believe, don't quote me guys because I don't know if this is going to be uh, correct, but I believe that the next uh, class that they possibly release, we may be looking potentially a minimum of 2 million crown boost. I could be wrong, but the way that these are obviously jumping up, um, I believe that is quite possible guys. So it is well worth to actually keep classing up. I know it's a bit of a time consuming to obviously get back up to max sabers and then keep grinding to get the classes uh, the price of the classes but it's it is well worth it in the long run guys and as i said if you are trying to do this utilize the daily reward as much as you can because if you can get your crowns and your coins total a decent amount um in your inventory when you do collect that you get the 10 percent boost so try and get as much coins as possible if you are trying to class up and then um if you want you can buy more sabers um and then keep then get a lot more coins then get the reward or before buying the sabers you can click your reward and then start the 12 hour countdown off again and then that 10 percent boost that you've just got on whatever current uh, coins you've got in your inventory you can spend that on sabers and then potentially that may get your sabers up a lot a lot quicker because you're obviously getting um, that additional 10% every 12 hours to increase your coins total. That could buy you maybe one, two, or maybe three uh, sabers, depending on how much you have got in your inventory and how much you get from the reward. So it is well worth doing, guys. And as I said, I will be doing a updated video on the daily reward and giving you a figure of how much you roughly need to get to um, to start utilizing the daily reward properly to be able to open the best egg um, on the top island so i'll try and get that done at some point guys okay so as i said this video was just going to be showing you uh, how quick to get back up to uh, max sabers after uh, getting the skeleton class which obviously the skeleton class is way op um you've got a decent crown boost multiplier on this over 300 capital u increase for me from hydra to skeleton Hopefully you guys um, have got the same or maybe even more. If you've got pets with higher stats than me, you potentially will get more um, from the boss. Obviously, I got a maximum of 444.465 capital U. You potentially could get a lot more from the boss with higher stat pets. You'll still get that additional 300 and something increase from Hydra to Skeleton. But the better um, crown pets you've got the more you can get from that boss so potentially you guys might actually be earning more than me if you've got pets that have given you more than 2.5 million uh sorry 250,000 on each pet so my four combined pets will give me just over 1 million crown boost um but these pets are obviously a few islands back so if anyone's got newer new island pets then you're potentially going to get a lot more um crowns so it is pretty decent so hopefully that has actually helped you guys how long it would take to actually get back up to um, Max Sabres once you get a skeleton class. And hopefully you've enjoyed the video. So before I do end the video there guys, I just want to say once again, if you are new to the channel or not subscribed, it would really mean the world to me if you hit that subscribe button. Help me on my road to 10,000 subscribers. Please turn the post notification bell with all notifications turned on so you don't miss any future videos, live streams and pet giveaways in various games including this one. 
please feel free to leave a comment in the section down below as I do try to respond to all comments that are left. And if you enjoyed the video today, guys, please smash that thumbs up button to see if we get about 750 likes or more on today's video, guys. But for now, guys, that's it for this video, and I'll catch you in the next video. Stay safe, guys, and peace out.